burrowing junction dates from the start of the Bakerloo Line and allows the tracks to pass beneath the southbound Metropolitan Lines on the approach to Wembley Park. For the next half a mile, the formation is eight tracks wide, with the Met having fast and slow lines, and to our far right, the up and down Chilton Lines from Aylesbury. Notice the reversal siding to our right. Wembley Park, with its six platforms, was always one of the major stations on the line, especially evident when the nearby Wembley Stadium was in use. For many years, up to half the Bakerloo Line trains turned back here. Cross-platform interchange allows travellers to the city access to the faster metropolitan services, which run non-stop to Finchley Road and again to Baker Street. Flyunder between Neasden Depot and the northbound tracks was built just before the Second World War. The depot is the home of the Metropolitan Fleet, and it was expanded and rebuilt at the same time to house both the Metropolitan and the then new Bakerloo Fleet of 1938 stock. Although used for stabling, nowadays the Jubilee's main depot is at Stratford. With the extra trains generated by the Jubilee Line, a new depot was opened at Stonebridge Park for the surviving Bakerloo branch. The depot lies to the left, masked by the A-stop train. At the southern end of the depot is the new purpose-built control centre, which took over control of the entire Jubilee line from Baker Street in July 1998. At one time, it was proposed to transfer the Metropolitan here as well, but that remains at Baker Street. first opened on the Metropolitan Line in 1880. In those days it was a mere village a few miles north of London. It was the only intermediate stop between Wilsdon Green and Harrow, whereas nowadays there are five. Wembley Park was the next to open 14 years later in 1894.
Chilton main line from Birmingham via High Wycom has now joined the Aylesbury line at Neasden Junction. Dollis Hill had originally opened in 1909 and is demanded by the inexorable spread of suburbia. But the four tracks of the Metropolitan north of Finchley Road, originally divided into fast and slow lines, unlike most of the other stations, Dollis Hill only ever had an island platform on the slow lines. With the start of the Bakerloo service and the rearrangement of the track layout in 1938, this island platform had to be newly constructed. Left to right, the six tracks here nowadays are Metropolitan and Jubilee Southbound, Jubilee and Metropolitan Northbound, and Up and Down Chiltern. The reversal siding at Wilston Green, complete with trains. Wilston Green was the northern extent of the Metropolitan Railway for just under a year from 1879. Although still provided with four platforms, Metropolitan trains rarely stop here nowadays. In the southbound direction, most Jubilee trains run the full distance.